Good morning, guys. Welcome to today's video. Wait for Jacob! <laughs> Are you okay? Come here. Come here. <laughs> In the trailer last night, and it was hotter than it was the night before, and they did not sleep so well. <laughs> I think Jacob might not be that happy. We are about to get back to a regular scheduled horsey video. Here. Chino Bambino. There you go. Bring them all. All right, let's all take one. So there's, all right, that's Willow. Yeah, that's Penny. Which one He's got mine? Gracie. Oh, here's Gracie's. Just be careful. She chews a one hole. Is my horse? All right, that one. That's Willow. Okay. The small one. Yep, the small one. All right. Holy moly! I haven't been down in the barn in two days. You can tell. Holy moly, moly. Uh oh, we're confusing the horses. Taking 15 years to get through the door. Okay, come on, Penny. Oh, they're like, what the heck? Look at their salt lick. It's almost gone. All right, Willow, give Willow hers. Gracie hers. I put it in her. Job, you guys just did chores, sort of. Do you guys want to help do chores today after we eat? We haven't even eaten yet. It's fun. Gabby and Sophia are making their way down. So there is something that I haven't told you. We haven't told you because we just haven't got there yet. But do you guys remember when COVID first started and everybody started working from home? And then Sam took a year off and he stayed home for a year. I think it was before COVID actually. Do you guys remember before in the past where Sam took a year off work? Well, the kind of work that he has, he can take time off and still get paid. Like it's a weird program. Like he gets paid a little bit less but he, it all works out in the end. But anyways, he can take time off. So he decided, we decided that he's gonna take a year off and he's been taking a year off. And it's been amazing having him home until he fell and fainted at a horse show and hurt his knee so bad and now we're back to, like before I would do, the girls and I would do chores five days a week and he would do them two days a week. So we all like had a break from it which if you have horses, you shouldn't need a bird. Like, you know, you can't always have a break, but being able to have a break has been such a good, amazing thing for our family. It's kept us all fresh and good and happy and excited and kept our barn going really well. And now that he's home, he'll be doing chores more often and we'll be having more breaks. <laughs> but now that he hurt himself, we'll be doing chores again more often. So that is what you didn't know. Sam is off for the next few long time and we're going to be able to do more things as a family go on more trail rides even during like the school year because the girls are homeschooled once he gets his truck which we're working on hopefully this week nice of you to arrive you told me that you went to go down. i did i said let's go down no. wow i thought penny was making noise eating but it's really ruby so ruby gets her hair cut this week thankfully she's at the at the longest hair she's had in a long time and I don't know, Sam is the one that books the appointment, so I don't know how that happened. It's glorious weather outside today, so we're going to go have breakfast, get dressed, and Brooklyn wants to ride today. Yeah, she came up to me and said, well, can we ride today? Aww. She loves you. Gracie's hair looks gorgeous, Gabby. I love it. Oh, did you take Brooklyn out, or Jake, Gracie out yesterday? Do you think you can handle it? All right. Do you guys know that Penny loves little boys? Loves them. Go. Keep walking. You gotta walk fast. You can't walk slow. <laughs> oh, look at her. Look at her. Oh, she's going so slow for him. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Look at you, you're such a princess. Wait, come on, one, two, three, Yeah, she's four. being really now. good. We have four now. Yeah, we have four now at home. We have Storm still. Storm. Okay, you gotta move. So, all the girls are in heat again. That means she has been home like at least three weeks. Willow must have been in heat because, what? Is that a boy? 
Yeah, I know. Just the brown one is a boy. This is a girl. I thought the other brown one was a boy, too. No, all girls, but just one boy. So I saw some people saying that people don't ever put boys and girls together, but that's not true. I see a lot of mixed fields where we live, and it can have a it's advantages it just depends on like what you it's want until they have a baby well they're not gonna have babies they're all fixed well the girls aren't fixed but the boys are fixed what what happens if i ride the boy nothing happens he's a really nice horse you probably won't be he's to bouncy him. but it, he's fun he's a good boy no oh, underneath the fence ow <laughs> did he hear it yeah did it hurt? Why well, don't we just bring him here every time we need to test the fence? Yeah, every time we want to test the fence, we're like, you touch it, you touch it. No, you touch it. Brooklyn, you want to touch it? It, it took him a good minute to get shocked. Gina wants to come for a drink, I think. <laughs> anyway, we'll be back. We're just going to have breakfast and coffee and then get dressed. And we'll be back for hopefully a good ride. It's so cool out today. It's glorious. Honestly, life is chaotic right now, you guys. It is chaotic, but I'm so grateful for this little wagon. Have you always like seen people with wagons like this? And been like, man, I wish I had one of those. And then Sam found one on Marketplace, and I was so excited. Because, essentially, it helps me carry stuff from here to there. It is the time for us take the grandkids home it was a fun time you guys having them here and it was crazy it was so crazy so much crazy <laughs> I feel like when you have grandkids you're meant to like not have other kids at home because it just makes it so much harder but we did it we did a whole weekend with them and Jacob really wants to have a wagon ride and I want them to have a wagon ride and they want to ride horses I just don't know if we're gonna have time like riding horses takes so much time and the girls have riding lessons today too So I'm being banished to Jacob's side? Yes. Is that what you're saying? Well, I would love to come and sit with you. It is so hot out now. It was so cold before this morning. I when you want to get McDonald's. Yeah, so when, if a Nana said that we can't ride horses, but we can get McDonald's, what would you go for? McDonald's. McDonald's. All right. <laughs> what about you, Brooklyn? It's hard to, it's going to be hard to ride today because we have so much to do. You'd rather ride? That's my Two people choose the Donald's and you choose the Donald's. He wins. Ah. Oh. Number two, you promise. Gabby, turn on this side. Gabby, are you driving? Go. Gabby gave all the dogs a bath today. It's been a really <laughs> crazy day. All the dogs had baths. This girl's going to get her hair cut, and I'm like, you need to bath her. Look at, she gets burrs in her. Get off. Get off, and I'm gonna come on. Yeah, she can come on. Go, Ruby. Go for a run. Dry off. You and Molly Bo. Here we go. The last trail ride of the summer. But not of the fall. There'll be a lot of trail rides this fall, huh? Fire pit. Look at our grass is all kind of dying. Next dream would be like horse pulled wagon rides. Just joking, that is not my dream. You guys got the best side. Look at Chino. Chino's never seen the tractor like this before. He's getting ready to run. Chino. Wow, look at that fine looking boy. He is looking so good and so happy and so healthy. He's back here with the girls, eating grass. Look at him. Oh my goodness, you are perfect. He's still looking. I'm not heading for the stars, driving down the boulevard at night. Playing cool, play on repeat, watching people on the street as I go by. doing some minor maintenance. Oh my gosh. <laughs> We're gonna hit this whole Gabby, don't do it! Uh, don't break that. I'm not gonna break it.
break it. Yeah, but that's going to break it. <laughs> This has been a wild ride. We'll be having riding lessons today. I'm just gonna check my phone and see. But usually they cancel if it gets too hot. Wow, look at the hair. Uh, usually they, this reminds me of Sam's hair. Uh, usually they cancel if it gets too hot, but Alvy and I had a bet. We had a bet. And if can if lessons are canceled, I'm gonna lose. <laughs> We're at McDonald's. Jacob is being a big, good helper by holding the seat because Nono and, and Gabby are gonna sit there. No, I'm gonna sit the sofa. You wanna sit there with Nono? Because we got this tiny little seat here for all of us. But anyway, we stepped in the P.O. box and we got a package. We're going to show you guys what's in it. Wow. To Laura, look at that wrapping paper. What are those? Gabby got something too. It's a gift. Yeah, sometimes people send us stuff. We close it up. All right, Gabby, what did you get? Air sealed. Hers is air sealed. Yeah, you can open it. So. Hey. I like No, I'm just opening Nana's. You can maybe open No-No's. Wow. That's cute. So we got a briar fin. That is adorable. Now she'll always be able to remember Finn. <laughs> Who wrapped these things? She's got you chickens and chocolate. Chickens and because chocolate? You're scared, because you're scared of chickens, apparently. <laughs> Two because of my purple. favorite things. Have you ever seen a purple chicken? <laughs> so uh, let's see what the girls got. And then I'll show you my beautiful thing. Just oh, yeah. wait, just wait till Nono comes. So Sophie got. Okay, so Gabby got. Those are cute. So those are from How to Train Your Dragon, and Gabby loves those. She got the boy and the girl. They're so cute. And wow, that's nice. So Sophie got the same halter that I got, but she's got the rings. That's cool. Wow, that's so nice. I love those, Gabby. Do you like those? Um, twelve. I got Junior Caramels. Oh, I like those. I've had those before, but I've only ever had the mint ones, not these ones. I definitely want to try those. And it's a little bag. Isn't it cute? It's a chicken bag. Well, you could put pencils in there. You could put makeup in there. I'm going to find something really useful for that. Does it? I love it because it's got chickens. And I smell. To be honest, it's the very first thing that I have with chicken, of chicken paraphernalia. I love it. Thank you so much. No, no, no. Can you open mine? Yeah. All right. And it, it's like a little field. Sophie loves the Palomino, and when she gets the Palomino and her new horse, which she'll be able to use that on any horse, really. So nice. Dad joke. <laughs> dad joke. Hey, my dad has. Yeah, a dad has that butt. Oh wow! He's like a sick quote. You like them? Good. Yeah, I like them too. They're actually really so super cute. I'll have a good spot on your bed. Thank you so much for an awesome, amazing package. I love this. I'm probably gonna put it in my purse and carry stuff in it in my purse. 
And I'm gonna let everybody try a caramel. Tell us a joke, Sam. What has four wheels and flies? What has four wheels and flies? I know. A garbage truck. A truck. garbage truck. I love this so much. And it's better than yours. It's got the nice rings, but I still love mine. Mine is still special to me. But I'm glad that Sophie has that. Thank you so much for sending it to her because I love the idea of my kids learning to ride bitless and having as much control as I have with my horse. I think we're in a tornado. Like, holy crap. Oh my God, people are pulling over. Should we pull over? We need to get through it, Sam says. All of a sudden, like you can see the rain in the, in the, oh my God. We're just blowing all over. I see the truck in front of me blow away, I'll be stopping. If he sees the truck in front of him blow away, we'll be stopping. But literally, it's like a tornado out here. We can't hardly even see. Look at the, look at the wind. Look at the, look past. That clears up out there. No, you can see it just sliding across from the, the sky. Yeah, we're almost through it. Wow, that was like a tornado for sure. Holy moly, look down. Wow, that was scary. I was talking I was talking to my sister on the phone and I'm like, we just dropped the grandkids off. And I'm like, oh my god, oh my god, I have to go. I think we're in a tornado. That's how scary. <laughs> Holy heck. Like, yeah, it was just a small area. I don't know. Thunder and lightning right yeah. beside us. Yeah, there's like huge thunder, huge lightning, and we were right underneath it. It was so scary. It feels like we were in a tornado. So we stopped so Sophie could try this on. And it's true, he looks adorable. You he look adorable. Look at, look at how he, he just had dinner. He broke his foot. He's very aggressive. So that's his bucket. In fact, this is our bucket. Yeah. I don't think that's safe. We should just take it off. We'll have to take it off because that's not good. I'll have to tell Dad to take it off. There you go. Good boy. Look at how cute. I love it. Blue is his color. Aw. He just loves you, Sophie. He's like, out of the rain. He's like, are we going? He definitely wants out, so he's going to take him in and dry him off and let him run around a little, but there's a really bad storm. <laughs> I just fell into the gate because there's a little hill right here. You're very right. It fits him perfect though. Chino is so happy being home, you guys. I can't get over the difference in him. Remember? Seemed like it took a year before he got happy. I don't know. When we first owned him. And I can see, I can Ollie. see. He's oh Al Ollie's here. I can see he's happy here. He's like, he doesn't even have any friends really and he's happy. I don't know what's gonna happen, but our horses could come home anytime. <laughs> and he's like, take me for food. Hey, Ollie. He scratches on that thing. Hello, look at how cute he looks. He looks like a little kitten still. Yeah, hello. He's adorable. Here's my people. Doesn't pennies. it look like he has balls? Wait a minute. What? How's that possible? I paid a lot of money to get those things cut off. Did you guys see them? Didn't it look like that? What the heck? Don't you know that you're beautiful?